everybody back for some evening stream slash afternoon stream. Been working on the craft contest entry a lot today. That is coming along super well, so I am excited to show that off to you guys when I get that done. Right now, I need to finish up this level on this character. Run a couple primordial pools would probably do it, just about. I like equilibrium, that's no fun. Oh, I've got so much pen at this point, it probably doesn't matter that much. Nothing up there, just wanted to be sure. And this map's too wide. Never sure if I covered a whole span of it or not, so I'll keep having a backtrack. Look at them map drops, holy moly. Swimming in them. I like that my pure utility linked unearth is chunking enough to pop packs and T11 maps at this point. I kind of wish there were more, like, different ways to scale minions. Just thinking about my m minion character at this point, because it's really, like... <coughs> meant to drop all my things on those guys before they aggroed, but I got a little too close. But minion builds are literally just grab every single minion node on the tree, and then get all the life near them. <laughs> They're all the same. I feel like the, the tree for 90% of minion builds looks exactly the same. Mine's a little unique on my hybrid summoner caster just because I grab some fire damage and pen stuff as well. But basically same principle. Every single minion node and then whatever's close by that also helps you. Want to make sure I'm being thorough. <laughs> Ooh. 
Apparently I didn't actually get my first cast off over there. That's why that pack was living a while. I should probably not just face right into stuff like that. Not a great idea. I leave anything over here? I don't think so. Just thinking, I wonder if a firestorm might be more useful than my golem in that cast some damage taken setup. Just for the life gain on ignite action, I'm rocking. Alright, I guess T11s didn't give me quite as much XP as I thought that would. It's a good thing the last map gave me a bunch of map drops, because those ones gave me zero. Um, got a couple race courses. Do I have an Elder Spawn going yet? Yes, I do. Might work toward that at this point, though. He doesn't need any attention. All right, race courses over there. So I'm fine running some race courses and just letting him spread. Oh. Well, we were gonna shower today, anyways. Run some race courses. The freaking worst map now. It's too OP, and everyone was doing shaped race courses back when it wasn't a red map. Now they just gutted it and it's a red map with no mobs. Oh wow. Too good. One nice thing about cremation is those delayed monster spawns are a little less annoying because I can just drop one and keep moving. Ugh, I can smell the stink bug. Yeah. <laughs> Disgusting. Stink bugs are the worst. Grab the chance orb, my dude. Oh, no enemies. This map is so trash. I kept getting stunned so I wasn't getting my cremation off. I'll go all in on these dudes. Come on, come over here. <laughs> Dog just bit it on the way through. Dog came leaping over, just BAM!
very disappointed when I found that I had a deafening essence of woe and then found that they're only five chaos. Might be because so many people are crafting weapons with the uh, like etheric fossils and stuff this league rather than essences. Like some shapers guardians might be kind of a pain on this character. Hydra should be pretty easy, but I'm so sure about the others. Mara's minions will be super easy because I can just drop a volcano on top of them. But Mara himself gonna be a bit of a pain because he kind of moves around a lot if you run from him. A drop. Clear and next. <coughs> no map drops because race course is trash. Okay. Say I probably have some dailies for like Verici and uh, Elrion. I need to do those before they roll over in an hour and a half so I can get my daily deals. That was quite a pack. You're not gonna like this, Vegan. <laughs> nice try, you goofus. Oh, hey, at least this one has double sulfite. I'm all about the double sulfite. Extra packs in the boss room. Don't see that very much on this map. Oh, pfft, this isn't the boss room. For some reason, I thought I was already in the boss room. I was like, this is an extremely weird pack composition for the boss room. I've only ever seen a single blue pack. Derp. What kind of essence? Scorn. Trying to get one of these corrupt essences for the challenge. No such luck that time. did upgrade them to shrieking level at least I'm looking for scorn dread misery and envy to use my essences on try and get one of the corrupted essences because I only need a few more harbingers for that challenge there we go now I'm in the boss room this makes a little more sense One, two, three, four. Grab the good bases. Inventory full. Oh yeah, I forgot. I want to be carrying a heat flask. What is going on? It's gonna log here because I'm getting like weird desync lag. I'm not sure what's happening. 
if it even gets me back into my map here. I've had the game eating a lot of maps lately. Not this time though. That's good. Forgot my inventory was full. Don't feel like clearing it just for random crap o rares. Yeah, I forgot I wanted to switch in a heat flask for general purpose stuff and only put in boarding flask when I actually have a map with curses on it, I think. Because it is a little awkward not having a heat flask for a lot of things. Alright, until I level again and can get my final jewel slot, I'll just get one of these crit multis as previously. Eh. Nothing there. Guess I can turn this in. That Rumvarax. I've already got two of those in my Twink tab. Guess I feel like doing any future summoner leveling. Really, two more maps, and this just hasn't evolved at all down here. That's weird. Mm, I don't have any uniques that are worth running on this guy. Probably pay somebody to do Hall of Grand Masters for me because this is not a proper build for that. I'll just do a shaped siege. Why not? <sighs> like better rolls than that, please. Come on, give me the 80 20. Uh, 78. It's close. I'll just do it. Whatever. <laughs> usually like at least 80-20 on my T-15s. Oh, let's see. I still need to do those dailies. That's right. I never did actually go and do those. I actually cleared this, alright. Probably not anything down from the start there, I hope. Hey Vlad, how's it going? Good to see you again. Really? A T11? That's what you're gonna do for me, Mr. T15? Give me another T16 instead. I've almost got enough for a full set. I wanna make sure I clear each pad before I move to the next one. Catching ghosts, not the strong suit of this build.
Don't roast me, totem. Doing some MF, nice. I have not done any magic find in a, a long, long time in this game. Probably not since before Act 4 came out, honestly. So, years. That was a juicy shrine pack right there. And I'm sure not getting much for maps out of this. I should have rolled it better. Should have stuck to my 80-20 rule. For high level red maps. I was just hoping I might get lucky and get one more. G16, so I would have a full set of those. Kinda want to do a shaper tonight on this character, maybe, I don't know. This is probably going to be a super short stream because I need to take a shower and stuff today. Uh, what should we do next? I've got T14s. Is anything actually happening here yet? No, he's just moving around here. Doesn't have any shape or contesting him or anything. He's just not doing anything. Coliseum, that boss is not great for this character. I think I'll avoid that. It's Crimson Temple because I like the map. Double bosses, but it's so badly rolled. Give me more quantity. Give me more quantity. Ugh, no regen. The one mod I can't do. There we go. Imp chains. It would run Delve 250 to 300. Nice, that's about where I am. Haven't pushed any deeper. Probably get onto my Gladiator to push to 300 for that challenge just because he's super easy delving. Him or the Chieftain are both really easy delving, honestly. This character is kind of sketchy in delves. Too squishy. And with the delayed damage, so I can't just immediately blast out stuff to freeze mobs or whatever in front of me. Man, this is just a garbage breach location. This is so bad. What an awful breach. Man, that was like the worst breach of my life. It was Ash, and I got one splinter. Ash is the one I definitely don't need right now, because I just killed an Ash. For funsies. over my own frost wall there. Nice, we got a return on this one at least. Invictus Metal. Shoot him a little further than that. Don't run from me, you. Stay in there and take it like a man. Oh, 
Almost full inventory. Did it? Did it go up or down? As in, are exalts more or less expensive now? Price of exalt went down. Nice. I generally like it when exalt prices go down. I hate the massive exalt inflation that happens in a lot of leagues. Got pretty high pretty fast this league. It was up to like 110. Let's see those guys. Oh, there's an abyss here too. Had to throw me an abyss to make up for the fact that, that was the worst breach ever. It's a nice full clear. <coughs> oh, my wife must have put nails. Yeah. I can smell the nail polish. <laughs> Kills me. Oh. That was up to 112. Jeez, that's crazy high. 107. Yeah, a little drop. Hopefully it drops back under 100. That would be nice. Ugh. This is such an interesting item, like, in theory, except that AoE scaling is just absolute garbage now, so I feel like getting little bits of AoE aren't helping at all. Oh yeah, using Xana mods to try and get more quantity for more sulfite. That makes sense. I need more scrolls. Oh, now before I forget about it, I will go ahead and do... Um, these daily missions before they roll over. Man, that Elder Spawn is just not moving at all. Alright, Richie, don't give me some kind of BS daily mission. Ugh. He had one job, Verici. That was to not give me a chest mission. Especially on this character, because I like can't attack at all because my things linger for so long. Alright, come get it. Oh, I was kind of hoping that would loop back around. All right, I think I got her far enough away. Do that so nothing can come hit me while I open this. Nailed it. There's Verici 7. And Elrion. I believe I already did the purchase. Yeah, so I just need to do the daily and then purchase. Nailed it. What can I do for you, old friend? All righty, what map next? Some thirteens. Got some calderas. I kind of don't like calderas though. They're a pain in the butt. I do have a shape shore. I was gonna say I think there was a shaper stronghold there. I'll do that. a nicely rolled map. A lot of monster AoE. Whatever. 
Man, I should start using some Xana mods on these maps, to be honest. Nice. The instant return. Hmm. Learn from past experience. I need to freaking be careful around these Shaper robots. They hurt me badly for some reason. Watch my positioning there a little bit. Another map. I just found one of those like less than five minutes ago. Game wants me to try a build with two holy relics. Paper ring. I don't think they've done anything with map drops. They haven't changed map drops in a long time. You just get hot streaks and you get good streaks and you get bad streaks and you get awful streaks. RNG is RNG as they say. Holy moly, I do not speak Russian, Sepeda. A white wind. And look at that flat face and crit multi. Too bad nothing else good there. Ditch arena, all this crap arena. Not that though. I can sell that for a couple of chaos or something. Decent eye level shaper ring base. Why not? I haven't found any unique rings in a long time. My stash for lore weave is stagnated. Alright. Man, this guy still is just not moving at all. Do I have an arsenal? I do. I'm just gonna go around killing all the Shaper strongholds. No regen. My one undoable map mod. Hey, that's a pretty nice one, and it's got bloodlines. I'm gonna double bloodlines it for all the magic monsters. Deuced extra damage from critical strikes. Lame. That was a freaking sparse room. Where's all my bloodlines? Uh, it rained on and off several times. 
Oh, do we? I put a few buckets down there. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't know if it would catch anything. Man, another map with a breach and an abyss? What is this madness? I'll just come back and pick all this crap up at the end. is pretty dense. No map drops yet though at all that. What was that, Ethan? My oh, little dog. So cute. Maggie, good girl. Alright, I'm gonna head back down that way after, I think, for the moment. I'm just gonna... Well, I guess the breach is right there, and I'm not probably gonna be coming right back through there, so I guess I can just clear it out here. Drop volcanoes randomly all over the place. Already got so many corpses to use from all that other stuff that died here. Yeah, this seems like a super empty breach. Managed to open a couple things there before it ended. Sorrow of the Divine. I feel like I find a million of those each league, but that's the first one I've found this league. Garbo Breach Rings. Do I think that the build is boring and a waste of time? No, I'm actually enjoying this one quite a lot. And it will certainly do Shaper quite easily. I'm not real sure on Uber Elder, but I think it will be able to. I am enjoying it quite a bit. It isn't any kind of top tier build or anything, but I think it's pretty fun. This guy wants this thing. Oh, that caps lock. Giving him the big TYs. I would have stopped playing at like level 80 if I thought it was boring and a waste of time. 90 now though. On my way to 91. It'll get me my final jewel slot. Completed gambler, boys. All right. Yeah. Don't let that guy smack me too many times. Look out for the sub fizz rat pack. Ah, uh, giant balls. Oh! That was real close. My immortal call was on cooldown. The spikers almost got me. Oh gosh, and I just did it again. I even thought it right as I shot the skill. I was like, oh no, I just procked it again. I shouldn't attack these guys, but it was too late. Darn you, spikers. 
Also, though, why are the spikers spiking so much? Doesn't my killed enemies explode and destroy corpses? Wouldn't that mean the spikers do not spike? It should, but not working out that way in reality. These spikers are causing some issues. Well, don't want to die at this level. XP actually matters at this level. Freaking tired of these spikers right now, I'll tell you what. Spikers are my nemesis. Yeah, those spikers freaking tag me when my <laughs> mortal call is on cooldown. Did not feel good. Another group. I gotta be careful with these guys. So I just keep getting tagged like right before the spikers come in and then my mortal calls on cooldown. I get dumpstered. Spikers, stop it. Hate you, spikers, just go away. Really, Shaper? Get him out of here. Two more Orb of Horizons. <coughs> Head over here. Right in this area. Die, rats. Leave me alone, spikers. I'm tired of you right now. Alright. Oh, why did it have to be staff attacks? Garbo. Why in the heck did a full plate make it through the item filter? Man, no map drops and I died to the dirty spikers? That's a bad map. <laughs> Oh, I still have quite a lot of T11s. I could just spam out some waterways or colonnades with some uh, sextants on them. Do that, I guess. Whoops. This elder is just taking his sweet time over there. Just go all in on my T11s, why not? Deal 100% increased damage while stationary. That doesn't help me much, I don't stop moving much on this character or I die. Bloop, bloop, bloop.
out of here, Bubble Bros. Stay along the top here this time. Nice try, guy. Bubble bros are annoying. Oh, and give me some better map drops. Pick it up. Alright, that pretty well covers that. Oh, I got one more little pack coming right at me here. Finish those guys off. Pop, 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 pop. Next. Let me. me. Nothing real worthwhile there. One have less AoE for me. It looks like it probably does. That rare just like pieced out. What the heck? This time I'm gonna do my strategy of just sticking along the bottom the whole way initially and clearing that. Burning Rage, no thank you, that trial takes way too long.
Nice, a breach. What breach even is this, uh, Shoff? All right. That works. That's into the wall now, so I'll just go along with the outer edge. That was not a tremendously great breach. Kind of low density. Players that have 25% less AoE, I thought there must be because my AoE feels super bad here. Figured there must be one of those mods. Don't need a nightmare bassinet. Spent forever trying to pick up that sword just for it to be one I couldn't actually hold. It's a pretty crazy audio effect for that. That Nemesis mod. Man, my clear feels freaking bad with this 25% less AoE, yo. Don't like that at all. Last one in there. That are double bosses, nice. Need to find more essences so I can get my corrupted essence challenge. All these little plebs hiding down below. Get 
Here we go. There's an essence. We've got a chance. Let's see if it has any of the right essences, though. Oh, it does not. Uh, we'll just kill it normal. <coughs> Big goons. Always make sure I remember to weapon swap back for clearing. That pretty much covers that. Done with all the colonnades. Oh, excuse me. Oh, man, I need to seek some more prophecies. Nice. Smell Rion. That's not bad. I am working towards Smell Rion level 8. Very slowly. <laughs> Got a ways to go, as you can see. I'm just gonna go delve for a bit, even though I'm not full on sulfite. Ooh, sorry if the stream's chopping a bit, guys. A red upload here. I don't know what's up with that. Man, my upload just dropped like nothing. Yeah, so the stream's probably going to be real choppy and crappy for you guys. I've had some really inconsistent uploads the last several days. Not sure what's going on there. Head back down to where I was here. Look at that. Like a one thing vol outpost that's freaking useless. Ugh, need to set up my mouse wheel auto hotkey so I actually have a mouse wheel so I can zoom out on this crap. Finally back down to where I was here. I was working my way over here. I want to go over to that thing. See if I can get a dank fossil. Delves are kind of sketchy for this character. Character definitely not a great delver. With the squishiness and the delayed damage. Take all that. Oh man, I missed the fusing. Oh well. Nice. Yeah, on this character, I don't like to go too far off away from the cart.
this character is not like some of the others where I can just kind of plow through mobs with no light or anything to get back to the cart. I saw a fossil over here is why I'm coming this way. I want to stay away from all the little spiders. That was just an aberrant fossil. Yeah, I'm about out of flares here, unfortunately. That was nice. One nice thing about the chieftain is I could totally just run off into the darkness with no flares for like 30 seconds and be fine. It's not the case on this character. So much popcorn. A divine orb. Nice. Yeah, next I'll head up there. I need to grab flares though. That is the third Geoffrey's crest I've found in the last twenty minutes. This is madness. Well, this can go with my personal crafting stuff. I think this guy's watcher's eye actually needs some more divining. As I recall. So that's what I'll probably end up doing with that divine orb. Freaking spiders are my nemesis. Prismatic, nice. Just chucking a bunch of flares there because there's a lot of flare cache right there. Refill me. Yeah, I'm just trying to pay attention to when spiders are coming in and just move away from the bodies. Because my corpse destruction just doesn't seem to be quite reliable enough to keep me safe from the spiders. You put it in Russian, Vlad. Maybe you're talking to the other Russian in chat, but I definitely can't read that. Yeah, it does. I don't think anyone's using it though. It's definitely not worth anything as a base. I've been thinking of doing a build with the Prophecy upgrade for the double relics. But I'm waiting a little bit to see if somebody else uses the relics a little more so I can see if it's even remotely worthwhile. Alright, now I finally get to go over to this fossil cavern that I was trying to get to. Map cavern down there, I like that. Depth 82. Probably have like one map container with a minus five map in it, but whatever. Move away from the spiders.
Just want to move around a lot here. Exiles are pretty dangerous at this depth. Whew, got him. Had to be dodgy. Oh, this isn't actually the fossil one. It, yeah, it isn't. Oh, yeah, it is prehistoric riches. Ooh, a shuddering fossil. That one's super expensive for some reason. I still haven't really figured out why yet. I'll have to go look at the special property it has. Maybe it has a really good special property on certain items. Some bones of wool. Eh, not perfect move speed, but let's put it up for like 2 chaos. I don't know. Like everybody, just like I did on my summoner, is probably just using bound fossil crafted boots. Toss bound plus pristines together on stuff, and it's real easy to get a nice pair of specter boots that significantly beat out a bones of wool. Stick the prismatic up for four. I'm just going to keep the shuttering for now. Before I go and examine it and see why it's worthing so much. That little bird like right outside the window. Uh, <laughs> yeah, sometimes they peck on the corner of the house. lay down some covering fire in front of me the whole way. Move to the side when these stupid little spiders are coming in. Nothing over there. Really lost armaments blowing all my flares on super bad things right at the beginning of this really long run almost out of flares. Still got a long way to go here. I'll just save some for a little bit. Maybe I'll run into a flare cache and get some more. There we go. Just what the doctor ordered. Gotten loot. Not a flare cache.jpg. Move to the side because those guys are going to blow up. Maybe. Holy cow, the spiders got me. Ugh. Man, I do not know what to do about those spiders. They are what keep getting me in the delves. Too, way too much damage are impossible to see. Freaking tired of those spiders. Hello. I haven't really had much of an issue with them on any of my other characters, but this character is just kind of squishy and those spiders blow me the heck up.
my gladiator would just block them all. And my uh, chieftain had like 8k health and a 79 cold resistance, so it didn't do much to him. Mm. But they just blow this guy up. I want to get to those maps. And I was like most of the way there too, that's annoying. Oh, get him off of me. I'm not even totally sure which spiders it is that blow up. Gotta really look out for spiders and make sure I move off to the side of the path whenever I kill some of them. Lame dash over the area where their corpses were like that. It's like I overloaded the audio channels or something there. Bunch of spiders, move away from those. Useless, but there was a bound fossil here. Move away from the spiders. Chaotic ones. Yeah, I made it there. Move away from all those freaking spiders. And how did I just know there was only going to be one container here? That is so lame. At least there was a T15 in it. Waste pool's T14, right? Yeah. At least we got some good maps from it. Bet we freaking died the first time on the way there because of these dumb little spiders.
anything? Not much. <sighs> Excuse me with these yawns. All right, what next? There's a secret map chamber over there. Man, all I want to do is go right, but I'm having such a heck of a time finding ways to go down once I'm over there. Just keeps wanting to bring me up as I go right. I forgot to buy flares, so I guess I just have to stick on the trail the whole time here. That's probably finally level 20 on my 20 quality faster casting. Eh, just a resonator cache there, whatever. Don't think it was spiders that time. This character just is not doing well in delves. Mapping and bossing and stuff is fine, but delves are a serious struggle. Some stuff just insta-kills me, and I'm not even that far down yet. Definitely gonna have to use either the gladiator or the chieftain to shoot down to 300 for the challenge. Saw that that guy was going to get an EMP off, so just preemptively threw the flare. Really? Graveyard? The worst encounter? This nice seven second long pause for nothing in this pointless encounter. There's also only one freaking chest here. Hide out. This guy wanted the shade breath. Well, brother, give me that. Hello. Hello. Right, I think I've got enough for like another delve and a half ish. Oh, only one, actually. One fairly short dwell delve. That's all I've got in the tank. Oh, I guess I've got two of the super short ones. are only 6.43 here. Ugh, why are you making me go up so much, bro? Look at that weird little layout right there. Whatever, I guess that's what I'm doing. Adding up. Stay away from me, spiders. Holy cow.
Freaking deaths are just eating all of the XP I'm gaining. Darn Dells. Stay away from me, spiders. Guess I'll take the nightmare bassinet. Layers. Stay away from me, spiders. I don't like you. Just move away from all the death explosions. Six forty three, is that exactly how much one jaunt costs? Does what the heck I'll go for the jewelry one. Might as well. You coming, crawler? Man, those guys hurt with their little pounce attack. Now, I learned earlier that I need to be careful in this encounter because sometimes there's like this lingering dot in here. I have no idea what it's from, but it does a whole lot of damage. Killed me after I had already killed everything in the encounter last time. There it is again. What is in there that does all that damage after the encounter's over? No clue. Jeez. What a crazy load of damage. Wow, the big freaking finds here. Alrighty. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Just a bunch of garbage. That's got too low of a life to be worth anything, I'm pretty sure. <sighs> yeah, it should be 2020 on my faster casting. Let's go ahead and vol that. Oh, baby, got it, level 21. Nailed it. 
23 quality is technically better than level 21 on faster casting, but that's alright. <clears throat> mm, yeah, I need to do an upgrade on that. Darkness resistance upgrade also. <laughs> Didn't even realize I was uncapped on that. Do that with the next chunk of change I get. Ugh. Exactly zero sulfite remaining. Feels good, man. Say so whatever happened here, he finally started spreading out a little bit. Why is it shaper stuff on low level maps though? That's annoying. Reef. Reef is a lame wad map. Run a carcass, because why not? Then I think I'm probably going to get off and eat dinner. Oh, we got bloodlines. And double bloodlines it. I think that's the best way to go on your T15s when you're trying to get T16s is try to get bloodlines and then Xana bloodlines it as well. Out of here, Lail. Lail Furia. Go ahead and not stand in that. Seems like a good idea to not stand in that. Oh, baby. Got it. The double bloodlines. So many blue packs. Based on how tired I'm getting and how much stuff I still have to do today, I doubt I will actually do the Shaper run tonight because I want to get this level up before I do, certainly, but... Uh, at least now we actually have 40 16 maps. Might even have a full set. I think Minotaur is actually the one I needed. Sure wouldn't mind another T16. No, that's asking a bit much, but would be nice. I don't have dying sun charges, so I'm gonna back out here. I probably can't face or insta kill this thing anyways. Just because it aggroes as soon as you come down, which means I won't actually get all of my things out. Oh man, I almost got it. That was close. There we go. I didn't quite get the positioning right. If I had added actually centered, it definitely would have single phased it. But I ended up placing it a bit in front of them. Yeah. 
You need more pockets, eh? Would be theirs if they were successful. Pretty weak sauce vanguard though, IMO. How to quick silver charges feels bad, man. Really? Come up. And that map gave a lot of XP. And of course it gave the T sixteen map. Very nice. That full set, yeah, it is very nice. Now I won't have to buy any to do a shaper run. Sure, I'll have to do some BS to get an Uber Elder run. Do not think I have a dig. Oh, I do actually have a dig. No, I said I was going to get off after that map, but whatever, we'll do one more. Give me the eighty twenty. Um, I mean, I would have done that because it was close if it had bloodlines, but no bloodlines there. Man, I just cannot get eighty twenty. Freaking awful luck right here. Burning through all my scours and elks. Holy cow! Finally. Hmm. I might die here. There's a very good chance I will die here. Wait, I don't want to do chance to avoid ailments. I would definitely die on that. On its own, that's not one I can't do, but with those other things, um, igniting stuff is lower, like, all of my sustain comes from. So with 90% chance to avoid ailments plus double added ellie damage, that almost certainly would have been Rip City. There's nothing up here. Pop them from up here, might as well be safe. I would run those super sketchy rolls if I wasn't getting close to leveling and really wanting XP, but... My current situation where I do have a lot of XP and I'm trying to level didn't deem it to be worthwhile to run those sketchy rolls.
Nice, got a plus one. And a minus one. Not gonna complain too hard about minus ones up here, especially since I also got the plus one. That's the best way to get this boss on this character is to just stand still after I cast. Because she always comes right to me. Then she just gets bopped like that. Easy peasy. And she doesn't hit that hard, so it's not like she's going to one-shot me or anything if I'm not running around. Unlike freaking Argus on Ghetto Map, that guy is very sketchy for this character. <sighs> Where am I? 60%? Ugh, with that, I think I'm going to get off, eat dinner take a bath, maybe work on my craft contest entry some more, and I will see y'all next time. Thank you for watching. If you want to see both guides and videos and stuff, head over to youtube.com slash I'm the winningest. And if you want to catch the stream, you can also follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash sandbash if that is your preferred streaming platform. Thank you for stopping by, and I will probably see you all tomorrow.